Whoever edited that is like for them. Um, thank you so much. This is this means so much. I can't even begin to tell you. Um, I don't even know where to start really. Um, but I suppose some thank yous, I guess. Um, you know, Duncan Gray, I want to say thanks to Duncan Gray because I auditioned for the big breakfast when I was still a booker at Models One. And I was, I was no one, I auditioned with um, Chris Evans. And Duncan Gray, some of you will know him, um, he was a runner, a researcher then, and he thought I was all right. And so I didn't get the job, but he wrote me a letter every time. This is when we had to write letters. He wrote a letter every time there was an audition that he said, you should go for this. I think, I think you might be quite good for it. I didn't get any of them. But, you know, 15, 20 years later, he was my big boss at ITV. And I thought, wow, this is amazing. Look, I'm still blooming working. Um, I just want to say, Pippi, my grandma, she's watching from heaven. She thought when I first did my first show on terrestrial television, God's gift, that it was a religious TV programme. <laughs> it was carnage, that show. Absolute carnage. We had nothing, we had no money, it was all in the middle of the night. Pajama party, Claudia, you were presenting that. And, um, and I used to go past Shane Ritchie's green room and go, one day I'll have food and drink in my green room. I just want to say thanks to ITV and Channel 4 for, for always being so amazing. Kevin Ligo, you and I have had lunch together for the last 25 years, every year. Thank you. Um, all the production teams, all the shows I've ever worked on. I love my job. I feel so privileged to be able to share it with you and that you quite like some of it, not all of it. I presented some turkeys, I know. Um, I particularly want to thank all my menopause warriors. given to me, the menopause. Hi. I know, it seems weird, right? But that I've got more out of doing my work on that, the documentaries that I presented, than I could have ever imagined. But one of my favourite things is when I walk down the street and I see a midlife lady, she'll look at me and she'll go... <laughs> and I go... Yeah. And it's like we're bonded for life. I just want to say thanks to my kids. I love my kids so much. And you can imagine having me as a mother, bloody nightmare. And, but Michael, you, Michael Douglas over there, the young one. Not the other one. Be, um, thank you. I love being on this journey with you. You make me a better person. No, Gilligan. And Don't try you make me so happy. Thank you.